gist are gastrointestinal stromal, stromal tumors. And they're tumors that arise in the gastrointestinal system. So they can arise in the esophagus, the stomach, the small bowel, the large bowel, or the rectum. They're different from your standard colon cancer or stomach cancer because they arise from a different type of cell that we call mesenchymal cells. The significance of that is they behave very differently. So they're not responsive. They're not typically responsive to chemotherapy or radiation and are treated with surgery and um, a systemic treatment instead of chemotherapy that we call a tyrosine kinase inhibitor. Around 4,000 people a year in the United States will be affected by a GIST tumor. The most, they're often asymptomatic and found incidentally when you have a scan for another condition or a colonoscopy or an endoscopy. However, the initial symptoms can be abdominal pain, um, rectal bleeding, or um, fatigue related to anemia. So kind of a low hemoglobin level, level resulting from some type of bleeding from the tumor in your GI system. So diagnosis is, the tests used to diagnose it are the CT, a CT scan to see the tumor or the, the scope, the colonoscopy or the EGD. Following that, they'll typically do a biopsy. So that can either be a biopsy that they'll do during the endoscopy or the, in, or the colonoscopy, or they can do it CT guided through the skin and obtain, obtain a portion of the tumor to diagnose what type of tumor you have. 